Hello friends. It has been a while since I made a video. I have not been feeling well, but I'm feeling better now. So today I'm going to make a video of some preschool activities. I will be using some dominoes, some popsicle sticks, and some pom-poms. And as usual, I will be sharing some free printables with all of my subscribers. Thank you all so much for watching our videos. Thank you for sharing them. And thank you for being a subscriber. For all of these activities, I'm going to be using this dominoes. I picked up this box of 28 dominoes at the thrift store. I paid a dollar for it. One was missing, but I can still do a lot of activities with this. So for this activity, I created this printable. It's a domino parking lot. We're going to be parking the dominoes where they belong. I'm only using the 12 that I'm going to need for this activity. So we're going to start with this one. This one is two. So we're going to drive it and park it where it belongs to. So then we would move on to the next one. This one is four. And we would park it. And then we would continue with the rest. This one is seven. There's six and one, that is seven. So we would drive that and park it. And we would do that with all of the dominoes. This is such a fun way to have your little one practice number quantity, matching, finding the right number, and just having so much fun. For this activity, I'm using my dominoes. I have one through six. I'm using some popsicle sticks, some glue, and some pom-poms. What we're doing with this, I'm using a marker. I'm going to make a line in the middle of the popsicle stick. And then we're going to add a little bit of glue on one side and I'm making this popsicle stick look like a domino. So I'm going to be putting this here and then I'm going to work on number two, three, four, five, and six. So when we're done, this is what our popsicle sticks look like. So what we're going to do now is we're going to match our popsicle sticks to our domino. Like this is five, so this goes right here. Okay, this is four, one, two, three, and six. It's a matching activity and again, we're just using what we have. We have popsicle sticks, we have pom-poms, and a little bit of glue. And you can make as many as you want. I went ahead and made six, and so that's what we're going to be working with. I'm also going to be using some dies that I already have. And what we're going to do is match our dies to what we already have here. To our domino. So it's one. This one is four. So I'm going to go here. This is six. Five. 
three, and two. For this activity, I'm using this printable that I created and some of the dominoes, some pom-poms, and a dry erase marker. So what we're going to do, we're going to pick a domino it's for my domino. Here's this one. So that is four, so we're going to build it. I can build it. So we're going to do two on this side and then two on this side, and then how many is that? So then with our dry erase marker, we would put that is four. And then we would get another domino, and we would work with that. So let's say we're going to work with this one. Three, I can build it. Okay, so let's build it right here. One, two, three. And then how many? And then we would just write our number here. This is a free printable. I'll go ahead and link it below. I created this printable. We're going to be looking at this domino. We're going to be adding so that's five, and then we have two on this side, so five plus two, and that is seven. And then we would do the same on this other domino here and here. So this is a free printable. I'll go ahead and link it below. For this activity, I'm using this printable that I created. We're going to use our domino. We're going to place it here. And then we're going to say that there's two and one. That is three. And then we would do the next one. That's three. And then there's two more. That's five. And then we we'll just write our number. Do the same thing with the next one. There's two and there's two more. That is four. This one, I have six and I have four more. So that is 10. For this activity, I'm using this printable that I created. We're gonna use our domino. We're gonna place it in this rectangle. We're gonna draw our domino. So we're using a marker. Now I'm going to draw my domino. Now we're going to tally it. So that is five. So we go one, two, three, four, five. Now on this part over here, I put the 10 frame and I'm using this little plastic acorns and we're going to put five. One, two, three, four, five. Up here, we're going to put the number five, and we have 
3 plus 2 make 5. On the bottom part, I have a number line and we're going to trace and go to 5. Go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Again, doing lots of different ways to get the number 5. Looking at our number line, the 10 frame, we can tally it, we can draw our domino. When we're done with this, we would erase this and then use another domino. Just a fun way to get your little ones to work on some math concepts. For this activity, I'm using this little tray that we had from the dollar store. I'm using some manipulatives. I have some snap cubes. I have magnetic numbers. Some little Uno cards that I found at the dollar store. The dominoes and a pair of dice. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to get a die, I mean a domino. We're going to put the domino. We're going to say one, two, three, four. Then we can pick anything from here. Like we want to get the magnetic number, that's four. If we want to get the die, that's four. Then I'm going to use a manipulative here. Let's say I'm using this little plastic acorns and I'm going to take four out. One, two, three, four. Then we would move on to another domino and we can pick several of these things. Like if we did not use the manipulative, maybe we want to use the little uno cards. We could do that. So maybe use the snap cubes. One, two, three, four. Just lots of different ways to vary this activity. Again, using things that you may already have around the house, like magnetic numbers, some snap cubes, your dominoes, and um, any kind of a manipulative. I set up this tray. I have some cardboard, I have white paper, some dominoes, tape, and we have markers, pencil, color pencils, scissors. So what we're going to do, we're going to get our cardboard. We're going to wrap the white paper around the cardboard. We're going to tape it. And then we're going to use our markers and make our own dominoes. Just a fun activity. Thank you all so much for watching our videos. Please leave me a comment and tell me where you're watching us from. And I'll see you next time.